Alright, what up guys, it's Chronic Cobra here bringing you some BF3 beta gameplay and I just kind of wanted to give you guys my thoughts on it, some stuff over it. So this isn't the best gameplay, it's just kind of the most action packed part of this match right here. It includes a triple spray with a pistol and I find this game very easy to get like triples and multi kills so it should be a really good montage game and let me know if you guys would like to see a montage of BF3 because I have lots of clips that I could use so if you guys wanna just let me know and if you guys have any ideas feel free to comment but we're just gonna get rolling here and we're gonna talk about the dominant guns in this game that I think are dominant <laughs> and the dominant they're the most dominant gun by far, I think, is the AK-74U, which is in my hand right now. And I use this gun because I think a lot of other guns other, have, like, very bad recoil control. Because if you guys didn't know, they nerfed the burst fire dice, I'm pretty sure. And for some reason now, when you try to... Like burst fire, it'll recoil like way up. So you have to like spray now, and that's what I don't like, especially when using an LMG, which I don't use very often. So I think in this game and the Bad Company too, it's kind of too easy. And I will use it once in a while. I won't lie. I like the M27 IAR or whatever, and the knife is very delayed. I just I just want to state that right now. I'm not gonna go into a whole special rant about it, but. It's just a horrible thing to use, so triple <laughs> Actually that may have been a double. But if it wasn't a triple I would be very disappointed. But anyways Yeah, so that's the dominant guns. I wanna talk about how like other games are similar to this one. I'd say this is basically another copy of it, Model Medal of Honor. But it's just like if you look at everything, it doesn't look much different from Medal of Honor. I mean the graphics looks like they've like decreased from Medal of Honor. They look more like a home front. And that's one of the reasons I didn't really like want to buy a home front. I was gonna buy it. But then I was like, you know, it's kinda pointless. It's just like Call of Duty or Bad Company. And it's just worse graphics. So what would be the point of playing a game that I do not enjoy? And yeah, so Basically, those are similarities, and it's a lot similar to the other games in the past. Uh, it show no, it shows no resemblance at all to Bad Company 2, and people are saying that it's gonna be a lot like it, just advanced graphics and stuff like that. But yeah, it's nothing like Bad Company 2. It doesn't even have the same feel. It doesn't have the same feel of any other game, except for maybe a little of Homefront and Medal of Honor mixed together, and just the way the guns shoot. It's Medal of Honor, like the AK and the AK-74, and by AK-74 I mean AK-47, I don't know why like, they mix up the guns, I don't know if they're trying to avoid copyright, but I don't know how you could get copyright on a gun, and <laughs> that's embarrassing, I almost killed myself. Okay, we're just gonna get on to the next topic, and it's how the game goes, like, how you move, how you jump, and I think that's very smooth. That's like the best part of Battlefield. Uh, how smooth it is, and how you move around. And one of the things I dislike about the way you move around on Battlefield is because of the way that you hop over things. A lot of times I get caught in between like hopping over the something to get into another person and it always screws me over and I always get killed from it. So maybe they could make it a little shorter to get over. Because it takes like very long to recover from like hitting the ground from that. And I just kind of want to talk about this map and the vehicles and all the exclusive battlefield stuff. Okay, I wouldn't say exclusive. I already know somebody's going to be like, it's not exclusive. It's in many other games. Yes, I know. But yeah, so... This map is kind of, I don't like it, because it's very unbalanced. On one side, you have the full advantage, and I hate it because it's all bushy. <laughs> and also, the other side, 
it's kind of like too many buildings and then we have the advantage on attack on defense you have a lot of advantage it's not like you have the advantage anymore when you're on attack now it's like you don't have the advantage when you're on attack you have to like <laughs> be special to win but peace out guys